I can't believe it's been two full weeks of being locked inside already. We are definitely fortunate to be in New Zealand though. It seems as a country we seem to be doing very well. We went quite hard and fast into the lockdown and that seems to be paying off. But wherever you are, we do hope that you are safe and well in these uh, very, very weird times. This week's actually been a lot of fun. We uh, we joined the flood of people that have all tried to cut their, hair, their own hair at home. So Stace gave me a haircut. I'm wearing this hat, but you can see to hide it because you kind of have to watch to see how it goes. But you can see it's very short on the side and you have to watch to see if I basically end up spending the next two or three weeks with a bowl cut. I personally think this looks great on this. In our defense, I do have to say, the odds were slightly stacked against us because we, we also don't have the right equipment, I'll be honest. We kind of do. Don't we? And even after watching a few tutorials on YouTube, confidence wasn't exactly at an all-time high. How do you feel about that? Not good. Anyway, we also tried our hand at baking, as it seems the rest of the world has, and that came with its own set of challenges as well. Oh my god, I feel like I'm cooking my face. <laughs> <laughs> but I think this is going to be a really fun video, so grab a coffee, come hang out with us and see what we've been up to for the last week anyway. So there's this thing in New Zealand called the bear hunt and people put in their windows all their teddy bears. We're just going for a little walk around our neighborhood and they're in every single house. And including one of the cars back there as well, which is a nice touch. This wasn't supposed to be for like to keep kids happy and stuff while they're out walking, isn't it? I think so. Or, or adults. Or like <laughs> middle keeping aged, us happy. Not middle aged, are we? <laughs> no. <laughs> I've aged a lot in the last like week of quarantine. So every time I go on Instagram, I see people baking and I'm like, I want to bake, but we didn't stockpile any flour. No. So I literally have half a thing of flour. I've actually been feeling like banana bread, but we don't have any bananas. So we're going to make date loaf. <laughs> And by we, I mean I. Dane's gonna film Yeah, it. I'm staying strictly behind the camera. We've just done a workout and I look like crap, but Stace, beautiful. Oh, thanks. <laughs> so what have we got? Talk us through the ingredients. So ingredients is just flour, sugar, baking soda, baking powder, um, maple syrup, butter, and dates. So all really healthy stuff, oh, all great to eat after good. a post-workout <laughs> snack. Post-workout nutrition, <laughs> one one. Finally chopped the dried dates and then put the dates, the sugar and the baking soda in and butter in a bowl. Okay, chop them up. <laughs> so what's your cutting technique? Just hack it up. Finely chop, how are you supposed to finely chop? Do you think Jamie and Gordon would be proud of that attitude? Gordon, Gordon wouldn't, <laughs> for sure. Maybe I should have put them in a blender. This nah, is going to take a really long time. I think it's kind of nice to have a couple of chunky bits in there though, or not? Also, I do have um, quite a bit of time on my hands. <laughs> How many times? <laughs> <laughs> oh, just a month. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? Like, what even are dates? Like, what is this thing? I'm going to put a hat on so that I can hide my greasiness, but it reminded me of a really, really lovely comment that we got, which is spreading the positivity in the world at the moment at a time where there's a lot of negativity, uncertainty, and everyone's saying, be kind, be friendly, be calm, be helpful. And uh, yeah, we got this comment, which I... <laughs> oh God, <laughs> Did I, re I read it to you, didn't I? Which one is it? Uh, it's, it's hilarious. This guy has got um, a way with words. It's almost, it's poetic. Uh, we're on step number one and we've already broken the rules. It says one cup of dates and Stace has told me, nah, do more than one. So, <laughs> are you trusting that this is going to go well? It's for flavor. It just didn't seem like many, right? Oh That's God. true. I, I feel like this, it's fun doing this sort of stuff. I would honestly never normally bake, but it's just the kind of thing that when we've got this time, when we're in isolation, I suppose it's cool to kind of do something a little bit different, a little bit random, especially while we travel. We literally, the last two or three years, have not even been anywhere near um, the chance to even bake anything. I don't even remember the last time I held a tub of flour in my hand. So okay, what's our next step? One large tablespoon of butter. Oh. Just to do this. But... So again, you're breaking the rules. They're, they're, they're just like loose uh, guidelines, right? <laughs> open for interpretation. The recipe is just like a pinch of this, <laughs> pinch of that. Is this the rest of the ingredients? This is like the second half of the recipe that we're adding to the cooled date 
and sugar and butter mm -hmm, mm -hmm. with our berry, with our flour, which I'm trying not to spill one single drop. <laughs> <laughs> that stuff's like gold. Looking good. It smells even better. Yeah, it smells amazing, doesn't it? Hopefully it turns out okay. Good job, babe. It didn't take too long at all. It takes longer to cook than it does. Oh my god, I feel like I'm cooking my face. <laughs> I'm not used to this baking thing. All right, I'm going to quick shower and then, okay. what, 45 minutes? Yeah, 45 time? minutes, okay. yeah. Yeah, just when you're checking on your watch there? Just um, 40, 45 yeah. minutes? 40, uh, yeah, 45 44 minutes. 44 now, cool. 44, yeah. Cool, 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 cool. So the moment of truth. I'm just going to flip it out of here. Hopefully it doesn't stick. And then onto the cooling tray. This will be upside down. Oh, okay. <gasps> oh wow, yeah. great job babe. Eh? It's definitely like, um, it filled out a lot, didn't it? Yeah. Good rise. Baking soda? Yep. Okay, how do I get it on there now? Mm. Like this? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just looking at mum and she said yes. She's yes. whispering, yes, yes. Good job. Oh, oh yeah. there it is. We did it. You did it. Proud of you, but well, look nice. at the amount of dates in there. <laughs> oh yeah. Yum. Oh, I'm not doing a bigger job here. It all comes down to this. Moment of truth. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Mm. Extra dates. Mmm. 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 It's crispy on mm. the outside. Extra dates, and then we did. Extra golden syrup. We did go off script a little bit. It That's pays not to listen it. to the recipe. <laughs> Trust the local in-house expert. <laughs> mm, that is so mm. good. Great job. Thank you. We've been keeping ourselves busy at home, learning new tricks, new things. Skateboarding pro now. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a skateboard. In fact, I've got two skateboards now. I've got another one down here because my niece and nephew like going to the skate park. So I want to be the cool uncle that can take them. But somebody wants to be the cool auntie. Mm-hmm. I've got a long way to go. <laughs> <laughs> so today is practice session number one. We're going to see how much better Stace can get learning on this bumpy, uneven driveway. <laughs> so after a little bit of practice, Stace is going to do her first solo drive. You got this. I don't got this. Come on. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yes. Oh, How do I stop? How do I stop? <laughs> Look at that, you're an expert Casual. in like 12 seconds. <laughs> Good stuff. Well, it's another morning. I couldn't even tell you what day it is. All I know is we are currently on the second week of our lockdown. Um, the days are kind of definitely all merging into one. I don't know if you can hear that noise in the background. That's Stacy's dad out there. <laughs> there with his tools. We've got this little uh, tiger alcohol... Um, like merchandise golf set that we've been kind of hitting across the the middle of the lounge like putting across the lounge but it only came with one hole so he's basically out there building the other one so that we can do some kind of a tournament across the lounge literally just <laughs> with golf clubs going putting across the floor on the carpet. Stace and I normally start our morning with work and a coffee but today we had a coffee and a game of Scrabble, which I'm pleased to say that I won by two points. But it's a bit of a scary day. I probably shouldn't have won because today's the day that Stacy cuts my hair. Yep, this is this is gonna happen. So how are you feeling about this? I'm actually feeling really nervous. <laughs> like I almost feel like I'm about to sit a test and I don't even know what the subject is. We've got we've got a shaver. We've got a this one, a two, me. and a three guard, I think they're called, or blades or whatever, but we don't have an adjustable thing. I actually don't care though anyway, like even if this goes terribly, which I really don't think it will, because you're meticulous, you're a designer, like you're... you're... Oh, I've got no doubt I can get the symmetry right, mm. but like, it might not, it might not look good still. So we've got a couple of ideas here. I'm going to show, show you a couple of techniques. I believe in you. I don't. <laughs> How can I help you? Um, here for my whatever time it is appointment. <laughs> I don't know what time. <laughs> Come in to Stacy's scary salon. Yeah. 
Um, as you're seeing, wow, look at this. professional equipment here. <laughs> Would you like a beverage? There's no, one choice. It's your water my, bottle. That's my water bottle. Yeah, I love um, that. And you'll just be taking a seat here. Yep. And we'll just keep you up. And is this a tripod on top of the toilet seat that you prepared earlier, or? You're not supposed to see that. <laughs> Take a seat. You comfy there? Uh, yeah. Sorry, what was your name? I'm Stacy. Hi, Stacy. Um, do I start here? Yep. And I just go up. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you can only do that when it's going, because otherwise the teeth just grab and you... Oh my god, I'm so... You just plucked my hair. Oh my god, this is taking off a lot. Yeah, hello. Ah, that's so <laughs> Why is it so short? Is it supposed to be so short? It's supposed to be short. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I, look, I honestly don't, I don't care. I'm not going anywhere. No one's going to see it well except for all these people watching this video. But, and I'm pretty sure there's people right now that are watching this that have either A, already had a terrible haircut at home, or B are about to do it themselves, so a little bit down at the moment. But that seems really thin to have up to this point. It always is. Yeah. Is there a three week reverse? We've got a three, but we're gonna use that for the bit above that. Okay, so I've put like a little template in place that kind of starts on the sides and then goes down a little bit. Then we'll be blending in up to the line that mm -hmm. I just created, but it's so short, like, <laughs> it's gonna literally look like a bowl cut, like... <laughs> In fact, if we were gonna do it like this, we could've just got a bowl and actually stuck the bowl on. So this has been a lot more stressful than I anticipated. I feel like I've done an okay job of, like, blending it, considering we don't have the tools. And it's now... Like awesome. <laughs> <laughs> and now, I'm just going to trim the top. I think I do want it like that much. Okay, well I'm not going to do that to start with, but I'll just do like... It's also been about an hour and a half. <laughs> oh my god. Wait. No. Oh my god. <laughs> How about that? I mean, for a first time, I am pretty impressed. With yourself? With myself. How do you think that went? Um, that took more hours than I thought it would and was a lot harder than I thought it would be and I have a lot of respect for mm. hairdressers and barbers because that is not easy but I guess they do have better training. tools and some training <laughs> a better, so, better training and better tools I mean that could have gone a lot worse I think I think you did a really really good job so Stace is like what I mentioned she is you are a designer you are meticulous so it took longer than it might for you at home. I would, I would suggest if you are going to do your own home barbering, maybe don't try with the whole fade thing. Just kind of like pick a safe number, go right up and don't try and like blend because blending is like... That's the stressful part. There's some wizardry or some art there that <laughs> I don't think we'll ever fully understand. Well, I tell you what, I'm never going to do that again. Cool, 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 cool. Well, that's a nice way to wrap up the end of our second week anyway. <laughs>